Here to my lovely, wonderful viewers, welcome back to another upload and I am back in Manchester. Unfortunately, I don't have Ozzy with me today, I'm here on my own, but I am very excited because I am off to meet Tony the Tiger. Check this out. So where I am right now, I wasn't 100% sure if I was in the right location or not. This Think Park here, I wasn't sure if it was attached to the place that I wanted to be. Um, but nevertheless, I thought I'd have a walk down, see what was about, see what these buildings were. And yeah, I ended up coming across a positive interaction nevertheless. Okay. Hey, yeah, yeah, I'm fine, thanks. Just filming the area. Quiet, isn't it, round here? <laughs> Just me on purposes. It's like coming to check out the area. So I drove past here a few times on bus. I thought I'd come and jump off and check it out. So, yeah. Lovely. So, is this a uh, part of the Kellogg's building? No, no. No? What, what's this part then? You got Bob five different businesses on here oh is it uh, is that what it is uh, there's a flavoring uh, laboratory right in the corner there's all different kinds of things oh so it's not today it's not all part of kellogg's then no. is it that were my main intentions were kellogg's so i didn't know if this was a part of that no, or no, not no. so so this is uh what's it called it's just called think park think park what what's that a flavoring company did you say no, no, you've got a flavouring company, you've got a virtual reality company, there's, there's a few different companies on here. Oh, right. right. Yeah, no, I was just like I said, into Kellogg's to go and take a picture of the big tiger and I just, yeah, just filming yeah, everything on the way. Everything. Yeah, exactly. Well, that's what I thought. I've drove past it that many times on bus <laughs> and I thought, you know what, I'm going to jump off one day and take a picture because it's iconic, in it? So... But yeah, so no, I just thought I'd check out these buildings whilst I was here. So obviously, it's nothing much to see, is there? So I'll leave you to it. Thank you very much. See you later. Yeah. <laughs> so yeah, big thumbs up to that guy there. Came out, was very pleasant, didn't ask me to leave, didn't say I was on private property or anything. So yeah, massive thumbs up to him. But yeah, that was a little sneaky peek at where I'm heading next. So, I've got a question for all you lot out there. Who's a big fan of cereal? Who is a big fan of Kellogg's in particular? Well, I am now stood outside the Kellogg's factory. Very, very iconic. Big Kellogg's logo. Big massive factory here in Manchester. Good, good way to start your day. Let's have a look, shall we? So, yeah, this is the main factory here in Manchester. Oh, there he is! It's Tony the Tiger! <laughs> oh wow! Tony the Tiger! It's great! I mean, you can't get a more iconic figure of Tony the Tiger, can you? I mean, who doesn't know who Tony the Tiger is? have these uh, chickens that go the whole way around the fence the iconic chickens I mean this is where the barriers are up to here and if you'll take a look down there, does that say 75 years? Make a 
see the logo up in the windows there. I'd actually love to get a tour of this place and see the work that goes into obviously Kellogg's and the creation of the cereals. Smoke coming out up there. Obviously cooking summit. <laughs> Keeping an eye on me in that security box. You'll find in Manchester that there are a lot of these old tram lines that are no longer being used. As you can see, this one runs up to here, which is obviously right next to the factory. So at one point, trams did used to run along here but it's so weird isn't it knowing that now these trams are no longer being used but at one point trams were coming back and forth oh we have a Kellogg's fan coming out here with the iconic logo there we go This is obviously the warehouse side. There we have a sign. Yeah, 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 no, I'm good. I'm just sort of like filming the Kellogg's building. Pardon? What do you mean? Can, can you come out? Because I can't really hear you. What? Can't really hear him, guys. Stuck behind there, and I can't really make out what he's saying. What do you mean? What, what do you mean? They're not making a movie around here. Why is that? Okay. Okay then. Not allowed to make a movie around here. <laughs> I don't know who's on the phone to right now, ringing someone, but... Well, I do have business here, I've just said what my business is. Well, but I do have business here, I've just told you what I'm doing. I'm 
filming the Kellogg's building. Come on. You need a big permission form. What? Who, and who do you get that off? From head office or something. We have the security on their way. Okay. So right, that's fine. So you want me to wait here? Yeah? It's up to you. It's up to me. Okay. So how long will they be? So security are on the way. So yeah, as you can see guys, this is the uh, warehouse and obviously we have the lorries coming and going. So that's the delivery team. As you can see guys here, we've got these big wide open gates. There's the barriers, so I've not really trespassed onto somewhere but yeah there it says visitors so not really stepping onto any private property or anything as you can see these uh, barriers are open so it said security is on the way <sighs> Do I wait around or don't I wait around? That is the question. Kind of got what I needed to get there. That was kind of good footage there. Interrupt interrupted that interaction there, that lorry. But that was kind of good footage at the same time. <laughs> I'm just going to keep walking around and if the security wants to catch up with me then they're more than welcome to. Yeah, looks like we're at the back of the warehouse here and this is where all the iconic vans are. I wonder if there's a different lorry for different cereal boxes. Because there we have Cocoa Pops. The one that just passed me then with our Crunchy Nut. I've seen one for Kellogg's Corn Flakes. So I am presuming there's a different lorry for all the different brands of cereals to do, related to Kellogg's. The, that's the one that's just passed me coming in. There we go. Again, really good footage this is. Eyes on the road, please. Exactly, exactly right. Eyes on the road. is where the staff must come into staff entrance we have a smoking bay over there for them so yeah massive 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 factory really really iconic factory so for that guy to say that I can't film here yet is just Bizarre. <laughs> I think if you look closely in there you can see a crate full of cereal boxes so this van is ready to be loaded up and taken probably to the supermarkets across across the country. See if we can get any more vans that are coming along around here. Right, 
that's probably bringing in the uh, the ingredients I'm guessing <laughs> Why is that? <laughs> because it's we don't often get like really, really. Uh, even a dinner can it, uh, that's Tony the Tiger though. You don't get people going to take pictures of Tony the Tiger. Sometimes we get like cars pull up. <laughs> yeah. There you go then. So you know, come on, this is Tony the Tiger. How can that? Do you know what? <laughs> Honestly, I, I've drove past here so many times, I've come past here so many times at bus and I'm thinking, I need to go get a picture with Tony the Tiger, so yeah, it's a big place, isn't it? Big, big, big place, so yeah, what's it, so what is that? I take it that's the same way they make it and then this is the delivery point, yeah. <laughs> nice one, mate. Thank you very much, thank you. Tell everyone not to be scared, I'm just coming to take a picture. Cheers. <laughs> There we go. See, guys, that's how it's done. That's how it's done. Very friendly. Nothing, you know, making a lot of people nervous. Well, then they can come and ask, but it's Tony the Tiger. I mean, come on. How more people haven't come and taken a picture of Tony the Tiger is beyond me. So there we have it guys, there we have it, that's uh, that's Kellogg's <laughs> for you. So what do you put that down as? A pass or a fail? Personally, that guy then straight away seemed pretty reasonable. But the guy in the security hut telling me I'm not allowed to film here. <laughs> he's, he's another story. But you let me know what you think down in the comments below if Kellogg's building here is a pass or a fail. So there we go guys, what do you make of that audit there? Let me know down in the comments section as usual and as always please like, share and subscribe and until the next time, bye! What's going on here? Boxing. What? Boxing? Is yeah. it boxing? Uh, so yeah, boxing's so. allowed on, but concerts aren't allowed on. It's uh, behind closed doors. Ah. It's on Sky I was like, quite coming back here and I'm thinking, I didn't think it was open, so I'm like, wait no, for this place to open. Doors. Do you know when uh, concerts are going to be starting up again? About September, they reckon. Really? Because yeah. I've got it a couple of tickets. On, yeah. Oh. Because I, I've got, I had a couple of tickets for May actually, so it's like I keep coming past seeing if it's open, and then I've just seen all this, and I'm like, is it open? <laughs> Stages, you know, this is the first stage, so. Yeah, I hope so. Do you think it'll get back to normal then? Normal concerts? Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. that'll be good. I hope so. I really do hope so. When no, that's yeah, 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 yeah. I, I hope they do because I'm dying to come to another concert again. <laughs> Thank you very much. So guys, if boxing is allowed on, I know it says it's like behind closed doors, but if boxing's allowed on, then surely they've got to start putting concerts back on, haven't they? But who agrees with me? If boxing's allowed, which actually, if you think about it, is a close contact sport, then should they not start putting concerts back on? I really hope so. So it says September, so I will be back in September to come and check to make sure then doors are open.